guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Abby here. So, I know I'm not usually in, well, behind the camera, but, um, it is, like, a review of all my horses and horse, like, collection. So, I thought it'd be easy to be behind the camera and you just see my hands. That's probably how I'm going to be doing my unboxing videos. Now, if you watched my last channel, you know I used, like, a white sheet behind it. So, that's why that is there. It is my sweet toy channel um yeah so that is my sweet toy channel logo before i switched to this channel and um so if you watched my old channel you know what i'm talking about you know what you know what this is but if you haven't watched it you could go watch it you could not i'm not gonna lie it wasn't the best video channel it was literally just me unboxing toys i had like five videos which wasn't the best videos so that's why i switched to this this channel and speaking of this channel i think we should get back to it so i in my last video like my second to last video i said i collect host toys so i thought it would be fun to show you all my host collection so there's a box of hosts right there and then two sets i'm gonna start with the sets the two sets and then go on to the host box so, this is a spirit riding free toy. It comes with a horse. The horse is this black horse right here. And it came with some accessories, but the accessories are in the box. But I think I'm just going to show you this for now. Um, This, I love spirit riding free. If you don't know what it is, it is a show on Netflix and a toy line. And it's about these girls. I'm not, I'm not going to tell you a whole lot about it, but if you love horses like me, I recommend you guys go buy these toys and go check that out because it is like the best toy line and, toy and show ever. I love it there's movies there's like four different types of movies and a a huge show it's like nine series i love it but it is a little sad i'm just gonna give you guys a heads up it is a little sad so um this is i don't know if the camera's picking up on this but i don't know if you guys can see this but there was a whole bunch of little wood lines and don't mind that sticker i've had this for quite a while now so that's just a sticker i put on i was trying to get it off but i'm not gonna try to do it right now so we're just gonna leave it like that but um look at all those wood lines i don't know if the camera's picking up on this but it is so detailed and look at all the plants plants down there and this pops out so the horses have extra space you could put food right there something like that i usually put food right there that's just me though then there's a horseshoe hanging up here a window another window that is fake um and then some apples apples spilling out some more plants and a bucket of feed or like water or some more apples now, um, I would like to see, I would want to see a little more colors, like if the apples were red and the these were brown, but I still love it. The roof is, like, kind of like this brick, I guess you could call it, like, wood, because it's, like, staggered, and I really like that detail. And then this opens up to give your horse more space, and on the inside, there's the same window. The window from right here, and I like it how it's on both sides, and this... Um, if you watched the show, you would know what this is, but I'm not going to tell you guys anymore because I do not want to be one of those people who spoil stuff on YouTube. So I'm not going to be that person. And then there's a lantern up there, um, some apples, carrots, a paint bucket, um, and some hay. And then on the floor, you, I don't know if the camera's picking up on this, but you can see two horses and making a heart. And then some more wood. I... If you guys watch the show, you know that's still, like, um, they're kind of, like, logo, I guess you could call it. Um, and then there's some more plants on the side. And the door that swings, but it is currently not opening. Okay, it opens, and then it kind of, like, locks into place. So, that is this stable. I And I don't... I don't think it's supposed to be like this, but I use this as a handle, so like, and the horse can just stay in here without falling out. And I kind of like take it on the go. Like me and my, me and my family go up in the mountains a lot, so I like I sometimes take that up there, and just doing that is like really good. Um, this 
is another place that I had for like quite a while. This came from Walmart. I don't know where that came from because I got that for my birthday. So, but this I know came from Walmart. It is not a spirit brand. It is a different horse brand. But it is, there is some fencing pieces, but it, that is, the fencing pieces are in the box, which I will show you in a little bit. But the stables have some hooks um, to put the fence pieces on, two stables, and um, it is breaking a little bit. Like, that back piece right there keeps, like, popping out. So, um, but that's just because I've had it for a while. So, um... Here's a side view, here's a back view, but I just love all the window space because it's easy to put your hands in for little kids. I wouldn't recommend this for, like, little kids just because it's so flimsy. I don't want them to break it or anything. And then, like, the, and then the colors are blue or, like, tealish pink with a purple top and the purple top is like so it feels so good on your hands like i will i can just do this all day it is so like relaxing um so yeah that's this stable it is pretty simple because it is i just knocked them down it is supposed to be just a regular like stall with a little patch paddock i guess it's not supposed to be like this where it's like it's full like playset. But this is, that still counts as a playset. Now moving on to the toys. Well, the horses. The moment you've all been waiting for. Well, I don't know. Um, okay. Let's start with this one. This is, if you watch the show Spirit Riding Free, this is a horse from Spirit Riding Free. All I'm going to tell you is her name is Chicky Linda. That's all I'm going to tell you. I, Like I said, I am not going to be the one who spoils stuff all over YouTube. I'm not that person. I barely even spoil stuff in real life. But she has a, like, a plastic mane, I guess you could call it. That's kind of, like, bendable. I wouldn't try to bend it, but I guess you could bend it if you really wanted to. She does not come with a saddle. It is just the horse. It doesn't come with, like, a, a doll or, like, a st or saddle or anything like that, which I really like because I could use that as a model horse, just decorations around my room. And then her tail is supposed to be, like, flipped on her leg, but you can move it like that. Um, but her tail, I don't know, I don't know, I'm gonna try to do this, but the tail has, like, a place where her leg can go. Because it's, because it's actually supposed to be, like, whipping around her tail. And I love those eyebrows. I mean, I, the eyebrows are just so cute. So she's going to go right there. On to the next horse who has very crazy hair. He had a bad hair day. Um, it is a also a horse from Spirit Riding Free. It did come with that stable, right? It came with the blue stable. And he did come with a saddle. Um... Okay, he just keeps falling down. Okay, I'm gonna put him right there. Cause he is, he is probably my smallest horse toy I have. But this is the saddle he came with. You can clip it on. Okay, this guy, he does not wanna agree with me today. Okay, you stay right there while I put your saddle on. Well, I'm probably not gonna, okay. I'm not gonna clip it on, but I'm just gonna show you what it looks like. He does have a bridle, but I don't wanna attempt to put that on cause he already saw how the saddle went. So, I don't know what type of breed of horse he is. Um, I know what type of breed she is. Um, it actually said in a book I was reading. But, anyway, um, I'm not going to say the breed she is. You guys got to watch the show for that. Remember, it's on Netflix. But, I wanna, he, he's never appeared in the show before. Well, I don't think he has. I haven't, I haven't watched the show in a while. But, um, he, I don't remember appearing in the show. Um, so, and, so, I don't know his name, and I don't have a name for him. I don't really have a name that sticks with him. The only reason she has a name is because the, she already had a name, like, in the show. Because she is one of, like, the main horse characters, so she had a name. Her name's Shiggy Linda. But his name, I don't know. I don't even think he appeared in the show. But he did not, he does not have, like, plastic hair. He has real brushable hair that's very crazy, and a, a little plastic hair up here. White streak and then black. I want to say he is American Colder Horse, but I don't even think the comp I don't know if the company was trying to make him a certain breed or if they were just trying to make a horse and you can pick the breed. Um, but 
he I'm I'm saying he's an American colder horse. Um or a saddlebred, one of those two. Um I've been around American colder horses before and they're pretty big so, and he's pretty small. Like if you compare him with Chikilinda, you see he is taller, he is shorter, but that's just because he kind of looks like he's slanted and Chikilinda's like more standing up tall, straight. Um but yeah. And actually, I will tell you that later on once we get all the horses out. So so he's finally standing up. This is my favorite horse ever. I love him. He is so realistic. I cannot tell you how much I love him. Every time I play with these, I always use him as like my horse. No one else is allowed to touch him except me. He is the most specialist horse. And it's not because he'll break or anything. Well, he probably will. But it's just because he is just like the most special horse ever to me. And he ha so he has real brushable hair. And I like it because it's a little shorter. But it's still, as you can see, it's still way crazier than the, just a plastic sculpted hair kind of. He does come with a saddle. And also, the saddle is also awesome. It also awesome. It fits his personality. He does not come with... He is not in the show at all from Spirit Riding Free. He has not come from the line. He has comes from his own, like, company line. There are a whole bunch of other ones you can collect. I got this one for Christmas. And, because you can see, he is, like, way more, like, kind of realistic. While those ones are kind of, like, cartoonish. Um, but that's fine because I do come from a cartoon show. I mean, I'm not going to lie. But he is a, he is so pretty. And I want to say he's a thoroughbred horse, but I can't really tell. But his face is adorable. He is the only horse that I have that makes noise and that can go like this, like move his head. He has a bridle that stays on to him. And when you push his head down. And there's another sound. Yeah, so he makes sounds. He is the only horse that makes sounds that I have. Um, but he is just my absolute favorite horse. Like, there's no other horse that can top him except, well, maybe another realistic cool horse. But for now, he is my favorite. The one that I own. So he goes over there. And I think he is a thoroughbred horse. I don't know. I, I want to say he's a thoroughbred horse, but he could also be... Um, a different type, uh, something else. I don't know, but, yeah. Now, this horse, this horse comes from Spirit Riding Free. And that's probably, and you guys probably know that by now. Because those two, he looks cartoonish, just like him, not like him. Um, but his name is Boomerang. Like I said, he is one of the main character horses, just like Chicken Linda. So, that's why he has a name, and... Um, so does Chicky Linda, but that guy doesn't. Um, he has sculpted hair up there and then brushable hair right here. He did come with the saddle. Uh, my sister broke his brad bridle, so that was kind of disappointing. He is an American painted horse. Um, I know I shouldn't tell you guys that, but I couldn't hold it in. Like, I think American painted horses are adorable. Like, I can spot one right away. They're just the most recognizable horse ever. Um, and his saddle is actually clipped on. That's because I already had it clipped on before the video started. Um, he has a different saddle than that guy, the black one. And I think I know why. Um, I think there are two different types of saddle. This saddle, that's a little more bulkier. And I think that's called a rodeo saddle that people use in rodeos. And then that one is a dressage saddle. So if you don't know what dressage is, dressage is a horse dancing competition. And the, most of the part of dressage is training like crazy. Like half the time you're doing dressage, like half, if you want to do dressage, you got to know it's training. Dressage is actually French. Dressage is actually French for training. So it's literally in the name. So he has a rodeo saddle and he has a dressage saddle because that one isn't as bulky. 
Um, I don't know if that is a hundred percent correct. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments down below if you guys know it, or you guys can look it up online. I'm good either way. Um, I would like to know as well. So comment down below if you guys know which saddle that is. Look it up if you do. If you already know, just comment down below. Okay. Um, this. Okay, I'm gonna move him right here. This horse is the smallest horse I own. If you see. If he'll stand up, you can see it's way smaller than all my other horses. Um, that is because he is an actually a McDonald's horse, and he did come from Spirit Riding Free. He has a Spirit Riding Free toy. I don't know if it says. It says somewhere. Okay, maybe it doesn't. But he is an actual McDonald's toy, so that's why he's a little bit small. He's smaller. Um, but I still love him. He's still a horse. I still love him. He is the only horse that has legs that move, so and his tail moves too. Um, so you can make him rear up or look like he's running. I don't know. You do whatever you want with him. But he's a McDonald's toy, and I don't know if they're still handing them out. But I got him, like, a year ago, so I don't think they're probably still handing them out. So, yeah, that's my horse collection i know it is so very sad i am trying to build on to my horse collection i don't do a whole lot of collecting horse toys because we don't do shopping a whole lot like it's not something we regular do in our family but i'm glad i just have them and this is the rest of it so a lot of these are bobby now you guys know i am offended of bobby i hate bobby bobby is my nemesis I'm, I just don't know what to say about this. Plus, this is my sister, so I'm glad it's not even mine. And then this is also a Bobby. Also a Bobby. Also a Bobby. Um, so, yeah, that's... This is the fence pieces I was talking about. So, I'm going to grab all those out. This is smaller. I will show you in a minute. And then this is, like, the feeding trough. This is, like, a tack box. This came with that. So that's why it's kind of cartoonish. Um, there's a trophy. The trophy actually came with him. A shovel came with that. And this came with him. And then this. Oh, dang it. And then the curry comb. If I, keep, if I can hold it up. The curry comb also came with him. Okay, I just dropped it again. I am butterfingers. Okay, so let's grab this stable. I don't know how I'm going to do this without dropping the camera. I think I have an idea. I have a stand, so I can just use the stand. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Uh, and, I, and I can use both of my hands. So, we only have three fence pieces i know i have more but i don't have time to go scurry around my house scurry around my room to find these so the i'm going to use three for now and this look at it you can you can see all the little wood the pieces and oh my gosh i so what you want to there's clips on the side and you just clip them in really <laughs> like the, it's that easy Okay, so it doesn't want to agree with me. Okay, so I'm not going to attempt to put them on because they're not agreeing with me. But this is a water trough or like a food trough, whatever you want to use it for. And this just snaps on to right here. It can be whatever fence pieces you want, but this is my extra one. And so that way the horses have access to it and you can pull some in. Okay, that's very sad. Okay, I hope you liked this video. Please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. And pe peace out.